Welcome back. Let's get your breaking news coming in. The maiden SSLV flight is complete. There has been some data loss in the last phase uh, with the ISRO chairman saying that the data is currently being analyzed. So the ISRO made history as a space agency embarked on the maiden SSLV mission. Uh, but now the control room is analyzing the data. Now, in the terminal phase of the mission, some data loss had occurred and uh, the official saying that they are looking at the data and will give details of the status of the satellites and the vehicle performance in a short while from now. Uh, Prapanch is joining us live with more details on this. Uh, Prapanch, there was a lot of excitement in the air and in fact the entire country had been waiting with bated breath to find out what happens next. It all seemed to be going smoothly when suddenly there was some data loss. Uh, now of course we are awaiting information on what next. That's right. Now uh, every, the whole environment, the whole atmosphere in the viewers gallery was electrifying. People were excited to see the launch of uh, the maiden mission of SSLV. Now, however, we can see that the main side of SSLV completed all the stages working as expected. So in the total phase of the mission, some data loss was occurring, and the ISRO had analyzed the data, and they have said that they will come back on the status of the satellite as well as the vehicle performance very soon. So they are in the process of analyzing the data to conclude on the final outcome of the mission. So right now, we don't have a clarity on what has what what is the status status of the mission as well as the status of the satellites and vehicle and ISRO will be back soon with those updates. Okay, all right, Prapanch, uh, thank you for joining us with those details. In fact, uh, Prapanch was there at the location. Several school students had also visited, uh, not just excited but also waiting for a successful launch. Take a look at this report. We could see a sense of excitement over here in Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sri Harikota. The SSLV has been launched over here. We could see the SSLV small satellite launch vehicle has been launched here. We have a group of children who were part of the development of Azadi Sat. Can you tell us what went through the process? How were you involved during the uh, development of Azadi Sat? Um, right now, jo abhi, uh, satellite wo launch ho and we are so excited. And our uh, work tha wo ye tha ki humne jo satellite mein jo sensors included hai, wo humne banaye the. Jaise ki Raspberry Pi ko, jisme humne do sensors banaye the, position sensor and a temperature and humidity sensor. So, ye launch ho chuka hai. Aapko kaisa mehsoos ho raha hai? Aap interact kar pa rahe the kai school students ke saath, 750 ladkiya, is pure uh, all over the country isme bhag liye the. Aapko kaisa lag raha hai? Aap interact kya un logon se? Yes, sir. We talked to each other and we shared a lot of memories and we uh, we are so proud of ourselves and our teachers and our mentors help us so much. And now Independence Day, how do you feel? We feel good that our satellite is on the part, our satellite is on the top, 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 our NASA and our ISRO will help us, our ISRO team will send us messages. We feel good that our satellite is on the top. People were very enthusiastic. They are electric, the elect whole atmosphere is electrifying. In fact, the children from across the country have come here to witness uh, the launch which happened at 9.18 a.m. Now, two satellites have been, uh, in fact, involved in this particular launch. One is EOS-2 remote sensing satellite with high spatial resolution. It will provide inputs on thermal anomalies, geo-environmental studies, forestry and coastal studies. And Azadi Sat is a CubeSat weighing around 8 kg. It will carry 75 different payloads. And this was, in fact, developed by 750 school girls across the country. It will perform various experiments, come to experiments, 75 experiments in this space. These payloads were created by the uh, children, the girls, nearly 7 50 girls from across the country and this is a moment for pride for all Indians including the 750 girls who were part of the development of Azadi Sat. So that was the kind of excitement as all stages are now done of course waiting for the final status of the satellites. We'll keep you posted on that. For now slipping into a short break here, be right back.